Alright, hello and welcome back to some more Assassin's Creed Unity. Last episode was basically the finale, but uh, this episode is just going to be like an after credits and like my thoughts on things, so yeah. Anyways, here it is, after credits, or after the actual ending cinematic. Oh my god, that's Napoleon. Whoa, what the hell? We're there too? Oh, this is like years later though. Holy shit. And it did say years later before, so. What in the hell? Ooh, there, there's this, uh, what's his face? Germain. There's Germain's uh, skull. Good. What the hell? Oh god, this looks like freaking. Oh! Let's fast forward. Anyways, all I wanted to say. I don't believe what I'm seeing. I won this fight two centuries before it started. Well done, kid. Uh, I don't think Abstergo will bother searching the catacombs for Germain's body. The bones are gonna be too damaged, too decayed. We're in the clear at this stage. You did good work, Initiate. Until we contact you again, the best you can do is continue searching Arnold's memories for anything else you might have seen. Like rare historical data, more DNA samples, anything to help our cause. We'll be in touch when we need you. Count on it. Okay, that was What's-Her-Face. Computer girl. I never really knew her name. I think I, I, they probably did say her name, but I forgot because I'm just a forget for forgetful person Anyways, all I wanted to say about this game was first of all bad Bad Parkour it had bad parkour bad fighting uh, the camera angles were a, They were just an abomination fourth of all or second of all um, why did I say fourth of all? Anyways, second of all, uh, Elise was just a bitch throughout the entire time, and no one, not only did probably no one liked her, but she also killed herself, basically. She went in there, even though we told her not to, and she killed herself. So yeah, th I guess those were the only two things I needed to say. Hmm. I want to see if there's anything after the credits, though. Oh, I think it's getting to the end. Once it shows a bunch of crap like this, you know it's near the end. Kind of like the score, though. Overall, I'd probably rate this a 5 out of 10. Would buy only if I'm bored. That kind of 5 out of 10. And I kind of was bored. Nothing really else to play. I'm still kind of waiting on the new games like Batman Arkham Knight. Oh, the most anticipated game right there. Batman Arkham Knight. Ooh, I already pre uh, I actually, um, whatchamacallit it. Uh, went to GameStop and I uh, fucking uh, reserved the uh, limited edition Batman Arkham Knight with the Batman statue and the free skin and booklet, something like that, and the uh, exclusive uh, exclusive uh, steelbook case for the for the game. Anyways, I'm just saying that whatever. Uh, but not only am I interested in waiting for Batman Arkham Knight, I'm also waiting for Mortal Kombat X, waiting for uh, The Order 1886, uh, I, I might do Dying Light, I don't know, I haven't been that interested by it, it's basically just parkour with zombies, it's basically uh, uh, Dead Island, only in a city, basically what we're doing, what they're doing in Dead Island 2, the new Dead Island coming out which is Dead Island in a city. 
Dead, Dead Island 2 and Dying Light are basically the same thing, only Dying Light has more parkour in it. And so I'm not really interested in either of those games, Dead Island 2 or Dying Light. Dying Light not, a, not yet at least, I haven't seen a lot of those uh, gameplays on those on YouTube. Uh, like, I don't know, but... Another one on- Oh, Bloodborne! <sighs> I never liked Dark Souls 2, never. I, I bought it, but I never beat it. I just don't like it, it's so different from the first Dark Souls. Dark Souls 1 is oh, always gonna be my favorite. Never played any of the Demon Souls, never played any of it. I haven't even like, I, I only know the name. That's basically it from Demon Souls. I think there's only one Demon Souls though, there's no Demon Souls 2, my bad. I think? Am I right? I don't think I'm right, I think there's only one Demon Souls. Anyways, I am so pumped up for Bloodborne. Bloodborne is Dark Souls freaking honor child right there. I'm even, I, I don't even know if this is real, but it's an honor child, whatever an honor child is. I just had to think of something cool to name freaking Bloodborne. Oh, I saw so many good freaking gameplays. The thing I'm wondering though is, is, is it like uh, we can actually customize our character or is he always gonna be that guy? Because I saw when you pre-order, you get a different skin. Not like a, like different, uh, armor or anything it's a different skin for the guy so i'm thinking are we gonna always be this guy can we not customize our character a lot like uh specifically uh you know customize our character is that it okay let's see if there's anything after the credits nothing nothing at all i don't think there's anything after the credits damn it Anyways, I guess that's all I had to say. Basically, 5 out of 10 for this game. I already listed out why I didn't like it. Uh, I already told you guys my most anticipated what in the hell. They t completely changed my character. Curtain call, you have earned a trophy. Thanks. I guess there's really nothing after the credits. Anyways, we're a single man. We kill a bunch of people. What else is there to love about this game? Other than it's horrible. Horrible. It. Just it. Look at that. I didn't even want to do that. Anyways. Yeah. <sighs> like, favorite, subscribe. Do what you got to do. Oh, boy. This was, I guess, 5 out of 10 fun. 5 out of 10 fun. Screw those criminals back there. Anyways. Thanks for watching my Assassin's Creed Unity gameplay walkthrough kind of thing. I'm Beastly and I'm out. Until next time in another game. Hopefully there's no Assassin's Creed game like this coming out in the future. I, I saw some gameplay videos for Assassin's Creed 3 and Assassin's Creed Black Flag and they looked way better than this. They looked way better than this, I have to say. And this was like a couple days ago that I saw these gameplay videos for Assassin's, the previous Assassin's Creed games. And I think these are... This, this game is absolute horseshit compared to the previous games. Anyways, that's all I have to say. Thanks for watching. I'm Beastly and I'm out. See ya.